Welcome back to another video today, I will be going over the new call update in a One Piece game and talking about all the changes made. But before we get into the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Since most of you are not even subscribed so click that subscribe button. It will motivate me to make great videos and help my channel grow, so it would be very much appreciated. Anyways with that out the way let's get back into the video. So before I go into all the changes in this update, I have to give some channel announcements. So, it's been like almost a week of me not uploading, and the reason for this is because I have gotten really ill and finally started feeling better. Anyways my plan for tomorrow is to make the fruit build I promised everyone before in a channel polls, but that is all I have to say. Okay now I'm going to go over everything changed in the call update. Also if people don't know what a call update is, it stands for quality of life, which means an update for the game to improve the quality of the game, which a One Piece game need quite a lot. There is now an auto spin option in the spinning GUI. You can use it on any type of spin, including title spins. This automatically pauses when it lands on a red title or a mythic title. There is a new item called World Call. Every time you defeat a raid or third sea dungeon, you now have a chance to get a World Call. This item can be used in 3rd C to spawn a world boss. The Pwn Glyph Merchant in the 1st C has been changed. When you go to the Pwn Glyph Merchant in 1st C, it now functions way easier allowing you to hand in multiple Pwn Glyph at once while being repeatable. New game pass called Plus to Max Quest, which adds to extra quests to your total quest amount. World bosses now spawn on a random chance of 10 to 20 minutes instead of 20 to 30, if they do not spawn after two attempts, then it's guaranteed to spawn on the third attempt. Final Phoenix Fruit is no longer duplicatable by storing it in storage and Final Phoenix Fruit can now be reobtained easily. The bug with Genetic Awakening was fixed. Mythical Rarity titles are now brought back and is colored blue, and the only mythic currently is Hero of the Marines. And finally, there are two codes which are on screen right now. Also, it's currently for times drops, so it's a good time to grind right now. Anyways, that's it for this video. I will be uploading the fruit build video, most likely tomorrow, on the day after, depending on how long it takes to make. Thanks for watching, make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.